welcome back to my channel in today's video we will be making aloe vera leave-in conditioner also known as aloe vera scalp treatment the things you will need for this video include a bowl of water knife cutting board aloe vera a blender and a, a strain net <laughs> or a sieve so i started by cutting my aloe vera into little pieces you can make it smaller than this but you don't want to make it too small because you will need to scoop up the juice i'm going to go ahead and put my diced pieces of aloe vera in the water because aloe vera actually contains a certain type of poison that makes our scalp itchy for those that have been wondering why when you use aloe vera directly to your scalp why it's itchy it's because you didn't wash the poison off or soak it off so i'm going to soak my aloe vera for an hour and a half you guys will see that the water will turn slightly yellowish or brown depending on i don't know uh, what you see uh, but that's actually the poison yes so i'm showing you guys that i cut off the edges of the aloe vera before i diced them this is what i'm talking about as you guys can see the water does change after which i went ahead and scooped out my aloe vera i wanted to show you guys how i scooped it out but i'm sure you guys already know how to do that next step i'm going to put this in the blender and I am going to blend it until it is very watery, right? So why it's blending, let's talk about some benefits of aloe vera. Aloe vera is a detangler. It reduces dandruff, which in turn reduces itchiness of the scalp. It's a natural conditioner. It protects the hair from UV rays. It defines curls. It's very affordable. It's less than $2. Um, it cleans oily hair. It straightens and repairs hair strands. And of course, it promotes hair growth. So now that I am done, and I'm now straining it with my wig cap. I advise you guys to use a brand new wig cap because it makes it so much easier for the aloe vera juice to be sieved. So now after that, I am just going to pour it into my container, my spray bottle, and I'm good to go. You can decide to add um, essential oils like coconut oil, any type of oil of your choice and whenever you are done spraying then you can put it back in the refrigerator that's it for this video please don't forget to subscribe like share tell a friend to tell a friend i will see you in the next one bye bye